I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you some questions on trigonometry which will help you review concepts and get prepared for advanced level courses like calculus. The question here is find the exact value of cos 105 degrees. It's a multiple choice question. We'll have another question for you to practice in the same video. So let's see how to solve such questions. One formula which I'm going to use here is compound angle formula which is cos A plus B equal to what? So it is cos A cos B minus sin A sin B. This formula can help us solve the given question. You can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. 105 could be written as a combination of what two special angles? Think about it. So that is how we could solve it. So it could be 60 plus 45 in degrees, correct? <clears throat> 60 and 45. That can help. Both are special triangles for which you don't need calculator. At times calculator may not be allowed for such questions, right? That's the whole idea. So 45 degrees is the triangle where these sides are 1, 1 square root 2, 45 degrees. And uh, 60 degrees is 1 where the sides are 1, 2 square root 3 where this is 60 degrees, correct? So we are going to use these two special triangles. So that is all you need to know to solve this exact value question, right? So you can pause the video further simplify the expression and get the required answer, right? So let's use this formula to expand. So what do we get here? So we had cos 60, cos of 45 degrees, minus sine 60 degrees, sine of 45 degrees. Cos of 60 degrees will be adjacent side over hypotenuse. Let's also remember so cut over, right? So sine is opposite over hypotenuse, cos is adjacent over hypotenuse. So cos is 60 degrees, adjacent over hypotenuse, that is half. 45 degrees, adjacent over hypotenuse, 1 over square root 2 minus sine 60, that triangle, opposite over hypotenuse, square root 3 over 2. Opposite is 1, so 1 over square root 2, the hypotenuse square root 2. Now if you add them up, we have 2 square root 2 in the denominator, and the numerator is 1 minus square root 3, perfect. 1 minus square root 3 divided by 2 square root 2 is the last option. So that is how you're going to solve it. I hope the steps are absolutely clear. Now let's go to the test question on the same. So this time, this question is for you. Find the exact value of sine 15 degrees, right? You may use this formula this time, which is sine A plus B, which is sine A cos B. When it is plus, it is plus here also, sine B cos A. However, if you have minus here, then we have minus here. Perfect. Now, you can always pause the video, answer, and then look into my suggestions. 45 could be written as difference of two angles, which could be uh, what it could be. 45 and 30, right? 15 could be written as 45 degrees minus 30 degrees. Perfect. And expanding, we get sine of 45 degrees, cos of 30 degrees, minus, so we take minus here, sine 30, cos 45 degrees. Use special triangles once again. Here is the review. So we have these two special triangles. 
if these sides are equal, we're talking about 45 square root to 1, 1. And if this is 60, this is 30. 1, 2 square root 3. Perfect. So what we get here is sine 45. Look at this side. Opposite is 1. 1 over square root 2. Cos 30. So from here, square root 3 over 2 minus that become this is from Sokotoa, right? Sine is opposite over hypotenuse, cos adjacent over hypotenuse, tan opposite over adjacent. Sine 30, opposite over hypotenuse, cos 45, 1 over square root 2. Taking common denominator as 2 square root 2, we get square root 3 minus 1 as our answer. So denominator is 2 square root 2, one of these three. Square root 3 minus 1, square root 3 minus 1. The last option is written in a different way. So it is kind of taking negative common. You could write this as 1 minus square root 3. Is it okay? So that's kind of trick. So, so it's option D. So we do have an option which matches. The only thing is think about taking negative common, right? So in multiple choice questions, Sometimes we may give you choices like this also. I am Anil Kumar and I hope you like and appreciate my video. Feel free to post questions and share my videos with your friends. Thank you and all the best.